My name is Nanette Salvaggio. I um, graduated from RIT in 1986. Uh, I graduated with a degree in imaging and photographic technology, a Bachelor of Science. I guess I would say my specialty is what I teach here, the photographic technology class. Um, the science behind imaging, not how to take a great picture, but how your camera takes the great picture and, uh, and image quality. Um, so that's what I've always done and that's what I was tapped to do here. And so I teach uh, the photographic technology class, which I love. I think our biggest problem is, is that students and many of our current students even tell us they didn't know that our, the photo sciences existed until after they got here. So um, what I would like incoming students to know, especially those that are undecided, um, if you st like science, but you like photography, it's the perfect marriage. We have incredible job opportunities. Um, everything from, we graduated students who are very successful studio owners, but we have people at Apple and NVIDIA and, and Valio, I, some of the up and coming incredible companies that are doing image quality work and putting cameras everywhere in the world. So this program allows you to to take and tailor your education to wherever you want to go. And uh, I think that's really our strength, is that we recognize what our students want and what they need, and we work with every student on an individual basis to help you get where you want to be. I am Ted Kinsman. I have, have taught uh, all sorts of things. I've worked in uh, optical engineering. Um, I've taught at a high school. Um, and here at RIT, I teach uh, photographic uh, instrumentation and uh, scanning electron and high speed and macro classes. I have an associate's degree from MCC right down the road. Uh, I have uh, a bachelor's of science degree from the University of Oregon in physics and uh, I have a master's in science education from Syracuse. Well, I've always loved uh, photography and I love science, so why not just mix the two together? So uh, that that's just seems kind of uh, logical. And it's, and it's an area of photography that there's not very many photographers working there. So uh, that's one of the reasons we stress it so much here, because it's a rare uh, combination of skills. Uh, currently, I'm writing a, an advanced drip, double drip water drop code for making a really nice water drip system which is one of the projects that's around the room right now that the students are, are working on an instrumentation and uh, I'm working on a big uh, a grant doing image manipulation stuff uh, for the military and uh, seems like a few other projects a few other articles I'm working on too. I really like that that we have uh, so much science involved in the program. Uh, I like students that, that go out and take pictures that maybe haven't been done before and then figuring out how those pictures need to be taken and developing the skill set to be able to to go and get those pictures so that's that incorporates a lot of photographic areas which aren't commonly used i like the idea of, of using really high tech and then generating interesting images specifically i like interesting images that are and then used for for educational uh, to get young kids interested in science First off, I'd like the program to be better advertised to young kids that are maybe graduating high school because most people don't know anything about the program. So we've got such great things going on here at RIT and the word hasn't got out. My name's Christy Sisson. I'm chair of the Photographic Sciences program at RIT. I graduated with a degree in biomedical photographic communications from RIT. The Photographic Sciences curriculum is an undergraduate program. Um, so it's a bachelor's degree, so four-year bachelor's degree program. There is no graduate program in the photo sciences at this time, so the degree program is strictly a bachelor's degree program. The primary classes that I teach at RIT are in ophthalmic photography or ophthalmic imaging, and so those courses are unique to RIT um, and unique to the photographic sciences. And we do some really cool things here. It never fails, I never fail to get excited by telling people all the cool things we get to do. Uh, and seeing and, and seeing people's face light up like, really, you guys get to do that? And uh, you know, like we get to do such incredible things here. I mean, we get to, 
and not for nothing, we get to photograph eyeballs. You know, we get to, <laughs> well, I think that's cool. Um, we get to, to, you know, photograph things under high speed. We get to do scanning electron microscopy. You know, we, uh, the, the kinds of things that we get to do here are just cool. And, and that's, we, we really get to do, I mean, yes, we do science and yes, we do, what we do is hard and it's difficult and it's challenging and it's problem solving and it can be a huge pain to do, but at the same time, it's, it's so fun. You know, some of the stuff that we, the things that we get to do is, is you know, there are things that, that most people never get to see. I think that's the thing about this program is that it's it's not one thing it's all of these things and and photography and imaging is that gateway right it's the gateway to get to see this and we get to be that gateway we get to be the gateway to all this cool stuff that that nobody else gets to be privy to and and we get to be the window to that and i and i just think that's incredible Cheese first. I am a cheese <laughs> walrus. Bring me your cheese. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna start. But something that is, um, sorry. <laughs> it's a, it's a, <laughs> it was the chair, I swear.